Hello everyone, Lady De Winter here, and today we're in my Minecraft single player game, and we are going to show you all the stuff that I did to it over the last few days. Um, this is the throne room. That is my very, you know, they're, they're okay thrones. I'm not very good at building that kind of stuff. Here is the meeting table in the throne room and all that and let's see we've got some waiting areas out here for to go see the king and queen and in here we have the great hall or the dining quarters um and we've got chairs we've got a little jukebox here since i don't have you know they don't have mu musical instruments in the game so and then up here I started putting in the bedrooms, um, dividing up the rooms so that, uh, two different woods. Wow. Okay. It's really stupid. Why did I do that? That was really dumb. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> anyway, um, we started dividing up the, uh, rooms up here and, uh, now this is the kid's wing, the children's wing. Oops. So, or guests or whoever. I should have probably made my castle a lot bigger, but this is a small castle. Next one I make, I will make humongous and make that like a major undertaking video series. So, um... I'm sure you're wondering why you haven't been seeing a lot of games on the channel lately, and I apologize for that. Uh, I've had technical difficulties with my software. I've had all kinds of problems with my health. And as you can tell, my voice is even just a little tiny bit rough. So, yeah. It's, it's been a real challenge. Uh, first, first off, I had a, I probably mentioned this before, but I'm going to tell you again. I had an allergic reaction to a drug. And uh, it did not go well. Um, I had some major issues. Do I want to do that? I don't know what that's going to be, but that could be a sitting area. Uh uh, it really kicked my butt and put me out of commission for quite a few days there. Uh, I had a horrific rash, as you know. If you'd been watching my series, you would have seen I had this horrific, horrible rash. You know what? I could make this wall all the way to here. I could, yeah. I could make this over to here. Would that leave enough hallway? Let's see. Actually, yeah, it would. So let's go all the way over to here. We'll take down this wall and yeah. But, uh, and then my blood pressure went a little bit whopper jaw and I was having all kinds of problems with that. And they wanted me to rest and not stress. And I don't know if you realize this or not, but content creation is very, very stressful. So um, I had to stop doing that for a few days. Uh, streaming is very stressful. So I had to stop doing just about everything for several days. And that really kicked my butt. So... This way, everybody's got at least one window. Um, I don't know about that. I might leave that. I might not. But anyway, this is going to be the kids' rooms and the, the, you know, guest room and all that stuff. So, and then up here, we have the chapel and the library. And up here, we have servants' quarters on the very, very top floor. So, 
And that's the castle so far. Now, I've also made a lot of changes to the outside as well. This is going to be the king and queen's quarters. And I think this might wind up being the children's quarters over here. And those are just be extra guest rooms. I'm not sure. So anyway, this is going to be the music room, I think. Although I'm seriously thinking about making this the library classroom for the children instead of the tiny, tiny room that I have. So now outside I've made some changes too. And let me show you those. I have added some grass area out here. And the reason for this is the fact that um, I don't have enough stable room in here unless I put stables all the way around the castle and that's gonna be a little bit difficult. So now here's some stable areas here. Here's the king and queen's horse, of course. They get the really nice stable area. But uh, I'm thinking about making like a little bit of a village or something out here. Uh, the only problem is I would have to make some kind of a door so that stuff can't get in here. But I did make some more um, tower rooms and you'll see this. So yeah, here's some more tower rooms for the guards and all. I got to get up, make a way to get up there. I haven't yet. So it's all a work in progress, folks. It's all a work in progress. And I'm thinking about closing all of this off over here too. Well, that wasn't what I meant to do. Uh, closing all this off. Now I could take this hill down here. I did think about that and just increase the side of the castle. I haven't decided if I really want to do that since I have all this back room here. Another thing I've been playing with doing is making a, a this another way into the castle. And that way we would have a way to get the horses and all up and, you know. So it, it's something I'm playing with and I may just do that, in fact, and put a higher wall around here. Now I'm in creative, so nothing will attack me and hurt me. That's the only reason I can afford to do this like this is because I'm not in, um, I'm not in, so now I need some dirt. Yeah, dirt, because if I'm going to take this down to over here, and see, here's the thing. Yeah. Uh, the wall would start from here over. So, yeah. I just can't figure out how to build something like this on a hill like this. And see, my goal is to get a walkway down here to this area. Now, I took all this down pretty low, which was a big mistake. I wish I hadn't done that now. Because now it's going to be hard getting the horses up here. To go over to here, because this is all pretty high. So... That's what I'm thinking about. I'm thinking that I, I screwed up in through here. But since this castle is just about finished, it's almost done, folks. So I'm really not predisposed to worry about it a whole lot. I am pretty much done with this place. Uh, yeah. And I'm thinking this should go right through here. Yeah. And see, we'll just put a wall in through here. I want this so that creatures can't crawl up here and annoy me. 
that's the whole idea behind the castle. It's supposed to be self-contained, so. And see, I could put horses up here. I could actually put the horses in through here. Because uh, you'd come up this way and then you could either come around that way or this way. And store your horses. At, but the thing is, and here's where I made my biggest mistake, mistake, was this building is too close to this wall. So what I might have to do is bring the wall all the way out to here. I could do that, honestly. I could take down this whole wall here and just extend this wall all the way out to here. I could do that and put a little tower here and a little tower right here. Okay, that that is a thought. So we're going to be refixing the castle, guys, for a while. Okay, now, what I think I want to do is, let's go, well, I keep doing that. I want to go here. Okay, now. We need a tower that is fairly good sized, um, but not so, it's just going to be a place for guards to kind of keep an eye on things. It doesn't have to be really big or um, fantastic, it's just a place for guards, yeah, let's go down here. Yeah, like that. Um, just a place for the guards to kind of hang out a little bit and yeah. Okay, that look yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, that looks pretty good. All right, now we are going to bring this up to this level. me sorry about that folks my uh i've been having some definite health issues lately and um there's not much we can do about it this will be our new portcullis i think and that will allow us to put horses along here and open up this wall into the castle because i'll be honest with you I screwed up. <laughs> I screwed up. And this actually here could be like a, a another uh, tower. So, yeah. So, anyway, guys, uh, the castle is taking kind of shape. It's, uh, yeah, I think that's as high as this needs to go. And then, of course, my arthritis is acting up a lot lately because of the seasonal change, which is making life difficult to play games and crochet and do anything else. So it's just, it's just been a really rough couple of months. So, and I do appreciate you sticking with me and uh, my constant need to change games okay now this one is from the corner one two three four five okay so we have one one two three four five okay now we're gonna go all the way to here So guys, uh, like I said, thank you for sticking with me and uh, and the channel. I do so appreciate it. You're never too old to game, but you can get too old to do many other things. Uh, that is something I am learning the hard way. 
you can get too old to do a bunch of other things that you would normally do. And uh, that is something I'm having, I'm having to grapple with, okay? Because it's really not easy having been able to do all these different things that I could do before and now all of a sudden I can't do most of them anymore. That gets, that is, that's a little bit difficult. That's a little bit difficult to deal with. And I have to admit that I'm not dealing with it all that great. So... Okay, yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay, now those are equal. Those are equal, okay? Now, oh, I am also having a trouble with my chair because my chair um, doesn't work anymore. <laughs> my uh, chair is very uncomfortable lately because it's getting older and it's starting to push through in certain areas that are uncomfortable so I'm just having a really, really rough month, week, year, whatever you want to call it so far. It's just been really difficult to deal with this. And on top of that, trying to keep, trying to keep videos going for y'all, uh, it's just, like I said, it's a little bit tough. ideas for videos of course we have the server but now the server owner is not going to be around as much which is not bad for the casual player but uh since i'm not a casual player i actually record here i really do need the server to be up and running in a good way so I'm going to probably be doing this game more often than I do the other one because I have better access to this one. So on days when the server's down, I'll probably record here. On days when the server is up, I will probably record over there. I'm just not sure, to be honest with you. Um, okay, let's see now. How did we do this wall here? We're going to take this wall down. Well, no, actually, we don't have to take this wall down. Come to think of it, we don't have to take this wall down. No. Well, yeah, we do kind of. Huh. It's just really hard just trying to figure out how to do this because this is on such a, a weird little outcropping of a hill. And let's see, we're going to do away with this. Because this is all going to become wall. I don't want anything to be able to crawl up into here. And that's why I'm trying to make it... Um, Okay, now, now what we're going to do is we're going to go like this. We're going to go. Yeah, something in that order. Hmm, yeah, back a little bit more because that's going to stick it out pretty far yes I don't I don't admit to being a good builder I will never admit to being a good builder because I'm not uh, but what the hey it's fun trying so okay now let's go down here and then here 
Okay, now that takes us down to here and we'll have the wall up here like so. Okay, now, all right. Okay, there we go, now. All right, there we go. That is part of the wall there. And we will make a stair step so that they can, I'm just gonna make this too thick on this side so that you can walk on it. Okay, so now you'll have a staircase that can come down. Like that. And a staircase that goes up and over and around this way. And then we'll take care of that wall in a minute. Because I think this one's going to have to be too thick also, yeah. So anyway, guys, this is it, this castle is a constant work in progress. Constant. It is always going to be a work in progress. So, and I am definitely taking down this wall. I'll figure out how to do this a different way. I may enclose the entire castle in one huge wall. I haven't decided. But anyway, just so you guys know, uh, I'm, I am recovering. I am coming back from uh, my illnesses and my troubles. But as many of you might know, recovery is slow when you're my age. So, uh, you know, sometimes that's just the way it happens, folks. Sometimes that's just the way it happens. So until next time, this is Lady DeWinter reminding you that you will, that uh, you're never, well, you are, t you can get too old a game. You really can. I hate to say that. That's just the truth of the matter, folks. You can actually get too old a game. Not to play the games, but to create content for them. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye-bye for now.